Hi everyone. So this is educational video how to maintain uh, your cassette deck. Okay. Uh, many people does this mistake uh, when they buy uh, the cassette uh, radio uh, even after even serviced one and they don't use the cassette <clears throat> you have to remember you have to you have to play the cassette time to time doesn't matter you're listening or you're not listening the cassettes but uh, to keep it uh, the deck itself in good condition you have to play the cassette time to time I will explain you what ha what's uh, happening when you don't play. So this is a belt. Uh, this belt is running the cassette mechanism. Okay. One sec. This is how it how how it looks new. Okay. It's all around. It's soft. And uh, here is a belt. How it looks after a while when the cassette is been not used okay imagine here is one flywheel here is another flywheel and the belt will stuck in this in this place and it's not flexible enough look at this one it's it's supposed to be a round one so when you when you after a year or two year you start playing the cassette this belt will, will not do the job you understand here is another bad example here is one more they get hard and they stuck in in in, in the in the pos position okay so you have to play the cassettes time to time here's one more and this is how it's supposed to look like see now here is one more small trick what you can do um, if your cassette deck start playing weird okay so simply put the push the cassette in okay and um, if your player started playing slow or weird sound, like try to push the cassette in, take it out, push cassette in, take it out, push in, go forward, go backwards, take it out. And this small trick might help a little bit, but you do have to remember that you doesn't matter you're listening the cassettes or not you just have to have one and just play it i don't know once or twice in a couple weeks or a month like you have to push the cassette in and just play for a bit especially especially these old ones like this one okay from like 80s 70s these radios so uh, also there is one more thing uh, try to switch the cassette brands okay and you will find that one plus one cassette is playing better than another one and um, the old cassette decks sometimes they are very very picky for cassettes so some cassettes don't play very well and don't sound very well so my advice would be just Try to find the brand it works the best for your cassette deck, um, especially for very old ones. Uh, ima imagine the cassette mechanisms and motor inside is weak, old, like 30, 40 years old. It's like it's it's a bit tired. So, <laughs> uh, so pick the cassette brand which works best for you. And um, yeah, that's it. That's all I want to say and um, thumbs up.